And now, live in studio, cutting through your typical media nonsense and offering you a rational and unbiased perspective on current events and life in Tampa Bay. He's a successful entrepreneur, published author, top listing agent, a real estate and finance expert that goes to bat for you every day as a consumer advocate. Your host and the consumer quarterback, Brandon Rhymes. Yes, here we are again, another day committed to picking a fight with the mainstream media and acting as your consumer advocate. We want to help you win in any marketplace. That is our goal of this show. The only thing I'm addicted to right now is winning. We want you to save our hotline number in your phone. At some point, you're going to need it. 813-670-7372. You used to call me on my cell phone. 813-670-7372. You can call or text that line with any of your consumer advocate questions, comments, concerns. Uh, we've had a lot of text messages this past week uh, for the rent versus own analysis, teaching you how to take control of your financial future and learn more about the many options that are available now on the buying side of real estate, getting out of that rental situation. Credit is always a popular, uh, you know, every time we offer a credit package, we get credit in there and uh, people really respond. Also, consumerqb.com is our, our website plethora of information available at consumerqb.com. You can see links to all of our expert contributors there on our website. Uh, we've got 80 plus show partners, CPAs, financial advisors, attorneys, all types of expert contributors in the home services space and uh, health and nutrition. Lots of ways that we can help you here on the Consumer Quarterback Show. we got a great lineup for you today as well. And we don't care if you're climbing a corporate ladder or if you throw a ladder in your truck on the way to work. Uh, we've got Ron Fuller in studio. Welcome, Ron. Hey, Brandon, I'm always so happy to be with you. And I'm going to brag on you. I saw your listing. Over $3 million. Let's talk about that. Yeah, yeah. 207 Coronado over on Clearwater Beach, just across the street from the Wyndham Grand. Uh, man, what a beautiful opportunity. It's mm -hmm. a prime opportunity. Commercial real estate for developer, uh, builder, um, entrepreneur. I mean, so many options you could put in there. And it's uh, just right across the street from the Wyndham Grand. You see the towers. You know, if you look at our drone video photography uh, that we put together from Fabre Frameworks, the official uh, real estate photographer. But what a beautiful property. I mean, great opportunity. Clearwater Beach is just a hot real estate market. Great place to live, work, and play. And also uh, on the phones, uh, we've got Miss Janelle McGregor representing Tampa Police Department. Welcome to the show. Hi, thank you so much for having me today. Hey, absolutely. My pleasure. And thanks for all that you do uh, to keep us safe, your whole team over there, keeping everybody safe in and around these events. So we've got a big event coming up. We've got Gasparilla Weekend. The festivities begin. The Pirate Invasion. Uh, how, many, how many guests are we expecting into the Tampa Bay area? You know, it's hard to say how many people are going to come into town for the for the parade, but we usually plan for hundreds of thousands of people to come and visit one of Tampa's signature events. Hundreds of thousands. I mean, yeah, it's um, – I remember back in the day, I think it was Gasparilla and the Super Bowl uh, in the same weekend, yep. and it felt like Tampa uh, – it felt like the population doubled. <laughs> and we'll be gearing up for that again soon. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Was that a couple years away, I believe? That's right. Very cool. Yeah, so we've got – you know, what we wanted to talk about today is safety. You know, we're a consumer advocate here on the Consumer Quarterback Show. Everything we do is all about helping consumers and, you know, protecting them uh, in the financial space. So, you know, protecting them from commission-based advice and all those types of scenarios that play out in business. Uh, but today more of, you know, hey, how can citizens help keep Tampa safe during Gasparilla? It wasn't, you know, just a, a little while back, a couple of years, I believe, you know, we had the Boston bomber at the marathon. I mean, these things happen from time to time. So we want to make sure that our citizens are, are diligent and, uh, you know, letting, making sure they can report sus suspicious activity. What's, what's some of your top tips that you have, Janelle? Most definitely. And while we train for this event all year round, it's definitely the citizens who are going to help us recognize when there's something off key during this event. And one of the things that we're asking them to do is that if they see an unattended package or just someone acting suspiciously um, in the crowd, in the neighborhoods, to notify the, the closest cop so they can check that individual out or check that package out to ensure that it's not something that's something or someone rather who's going to ca cause harm to the masses of people who are attending the parade. 
Yeah, that's a very important point. That's an important point. Um, so when you when you think about you know that as well, you know one of the flip sides as well. There's going to be a lot of drinking going on, and uh, uh, you know the ride sharing <laughs> services, all these different ways to avoid getting a DUI. That's that's a major hit for people. Most definitely, and and that's one of the things that we've been stressing to the public. While this is a wet zone event, uh, we want people to still drink in moderation and to know their limitations and to most definitely, if they do plan to consume alcohol, to take advantage of one of the ride-sharing programs such as Uber or Lyft or call a cab or, hey, you may have a buddy who plans on going out to enjoy the festivities but doesn't plan to drink who can take you home. Um, if you're not a nine to five drinker, as we've been saying, Gasparilla definitely probably is not the time to become one. Again, know your limitations when you're out there, but have a good time. Just be safe. Yeah, be safe. You know, last year, I think year year before, I think I decided I, I had a great idea. I'm going to take my boat out. I took the Freedom Boat Club boat out and was you know kind of trailing the pirate ship, and that was that was a rough day at sea to say the least. Too, too many boats, so I would not recommend that. There's you're, you're kind of playing bumper boats out there. And you brought up another great point. You know, if you plan to to drink, not only should you not operate a motor vehicle, but you shouldn't operate a boat either. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. And you, you see that happening. And mm -hmm. it's an interesting, you know, different dynamic. I mean, there's a lot of fun to be had. Just got to make sure you do it the right way. And exactly. it's real simple to have, you know, a designated driver, whether it's a, an automobile or a motor vehicle, motor vessel. Uh, you know, it's really simple to do that. And, mm -hmm. and we've got Ron Fuller in studio. I think, Ron, did you have a question for Janelle? Yeah, Janelle, I'm wondering, uh, as a citizen, should people uh, feel perhaps... Uh, unsure if they should report something suspicious or can they trust the police department to uh, just look into what they see? Absolutely. They can trust the police department to look into that because not only are they, excuse me, not, not only are they uh, going to keep themselves safe by reporting that suspicious activity, they're going to keep the hundreds of thousands of people, both adults and children who are attending that event safe as well by taking that one step of notifying the police that there is an unattended package or there's some type of suspicious activity going on. Yeah, and, and erring on the side of caution. You always want to err on the mm -hmm. side of caution. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I think, but that's a good question because sometimes people, you know, they think, oh, well, I've been drinking myself. You know, mm -hmm. should I report this? You know, they, they might get scared of, you know, turning on them and, well, you what, what are you doing, you know? And just just to kind of reiterate, Gasparilla, this Saturday's parade, is a wet zone event. So um, alcohol consumption is permitted along the parade route and also in Curtis Hickson Park. You just cannot drink with, within the neighborhoods. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. don't drink as you're walking up to the parade route. And definitely don't drink if you're driving on your way to the parade, whether you be, you're in a car or a boat. But if you do plan on coming out to the parade and you're going to be in that parade route or in the park, you can, you know, feel free to, to support the many vendors who are going to be there who will be selling alcoholic beverages. Yeah, there, there's a lot of uh, economic impact as well. You know, different types of vendors coming to uh, the Tampa Bay area and, you know, just the, the floats and just a really awesome experience is mm -hmm. Gasparilla. It's a, it's a really fun time for people to visit. Yep, exactly. There are going to be a, a ton of vendors out there, so make sure you bring cash yep. uh, because a lot of the vendors only t take cash. Right. And uh, if there is a vendor who does take a uh, credit, debit card, just make sure that you're getting a, a receipt for your purchase just in case there's any type of fraud that takes place. You have some type of receipt documenting that purchase. Yes, and if you just joined us, I'm your host, Brandon Rimes. We're talking with Janelle McGregor. She's a spokesperson from the Tampa Police Department uh, regarding the upcoming event here. Tampa uh, is getting ready to uh, be invaded by uh, mm -hmm. pirates uh, this weekend. So interesting, fun time, lots of fun to be had. We're talking about safety concerns and ways that you can be a good citizen. Um, what are what are some of the top things that you see or what, what else maybe we haven't spoke about, Janelle? Well, one thing that we're bringing back again this year is our text line. And if you text the word Gasparilla to 888-777, you'll be able to receive event updates and also notices on traffic right to your smartphone. 
so that's a great way to get real-time information on what's going on during the parade. So if there's a situation where people need to evacuate the area or if we just need to let you know that the pirates are getting ready to start the parade, you'll be able to receive that information right there on your smartphone by texting Gasparilla to 888-777. Awesome. Yeah, that's great. That's really cool. That's, you know, new technology uh, that you can utilize there and, and just get those alerts coming through. Mm-hmm. And not a bad idea just to do it prior to the event, I would think, just to get it locked in. That way you Most get definitely. updates coming in. Yeah, that's awesome. All right. So we got uh, how, what, what about outside of Gasparilla? How overall is Tampa, you know, looking, ranking uh, out of the state or maybe even out of the nation in terms of uh, overall crime rates? Well, crime is down here in the city of Tampa, uh, more than 70%. And so our crime here is thankfully relatively low compared to cities our, our size. And that's all thanks to not only law, the law enforcement partnership we have on a local, state, and federal level, but mostly due to our community members as well. And those community members, as we always say, are our ears and eyes out in the streets. Mm. So just like with Gasparilla, where we're asking everyone to, you know, report if they see an unattended package or someone suspicious in the area, those same actions have really helped us curb crime here in the city of Tampa as well, that collaborative relationship. Yeah, yeah, it really is. Well, thanks so much. We appreciate you uh, calling into the show, Janelle McGregor. Keep up the great work over there. Thank you. And uh, we appreciate all you guys do. Thank you so much. Thanks for having me again. Hey, my pleasure. All right, when we come back, more from our expert contributors here in studio, Ron Fuller in the house. Uh, We're going to talk a little real estate, maybe some uh, a little bit about the economy, some things happening, and uh, maybe a a 2019 prediction for you here. What's happening in the marketplace? Uh, Stay with us right here. We come back as well. We got a feel good story. Champion wrestler surrenders match. He could have won. Check out about this uh, really cool uh, display of sportsmanship here on the Consumer Quarterback Show. When we come back, don't touch that dial. Hey, this is Grant Cardone, and you're listening to Consumer Quarterback Show, hosted by my friend Brandon Rhymes. Do not touch that dial. I'll come right through the radio and grab your throat. To get in touch with Brandon, call 813-670-7372, online at ConsumerQB.com. This is the Cannabis Podcast, powered by TrueLeave on Radio Influence. It's an inside look and the scientific facts in and around the world of medical cannabis. Now, here is your host, Ian Beckles. He's a successful entrepreneur, published author, top listing agent, a real estate and finance expert that goes to bat for you every day as a consumer advocate. Your host and the consumer quarterback, Brandon Rhymes.
You're listening to the Consumer Quarterback, Brandon Rhymes, online at ConsumerQB.com. Brandon is Tampa Bay's number one consumer advocate for real estate and financial advice. Call Brandon today at 813-670-7372. All right, welcome back. Yeah. Thanks for sticking with us. Brandon Rhymes here, Consumer Quarterback Show, powered by Platinum MVP Realty. Check out PlatinumMVPRealty.com. And now with the Keller Williams brand behind us, real excited about the growth. A lot of cool things happening. Uh, the number one real estate uh, company in the world. Now we are, are part of that company, the Platinum MVP team at Keller Williams. Got a great buyer agent team. Of course, I'm on the listing side, great listing agents as well. And we can help you uh, maximize the exposure on the sale of your real estate properties, buying, selling, or investing. We would love to talk to you. PlatinumMVPRealty.com is our real estate website. And we also have a event coming up Friday. Uh, let's see. It's uh, February 28th, actually. It's uh, 6 to 8 p.m. over at Cox Media Group. Uh, we have a buyer seller seminar it's to learn from a panel of experts so all you need to know about credit mortgage title inspections and more uh, we've got our mortgage partners there title companies represented a snoop inspection we're gonna have the snoop dog in the house uh, aaron foley our buyer specialist we got william crowley the credit magician uh, gonna be there as well and we got a great team. We want to help you win in any marketplace. That is our goal. So save that date, February 28th. Register RSVP on eventbrite.com at 6 to 8 p.m. It's an evening event. We're going to have catered food, a lot of good, a lot of good stuff happening around the consumer quarterback show. So we want to help you win in any marketplace. Obviously, that is our goal. And uh, got a hot listing here on the beach, 1370 Gulf Boulevard, unit 401, million dollar listing. Bella Rosa condo, three bedroom, three bath. This is a great opportunity uh, at 2,200 square feet, $1.12 million. Uh, beautiful, uh, just a gorgeous beachfront property here. Tennis courts, you got the pool, you got the spa right on the beach, directly on the beautiful beaches of Clearwater. And it's on Sand Key, the Bella Rosa condo. Just a great opportunity for uh, the million dollar buyers looking for our million dollar players out there. And I've got another commercial opportunity in St. Petersburg, 7424 4th Street North in St. Pete, just north of downtown. This is a, a, a beautiful opportunity. It's a gas station that is generating nice, nice income, corner lot, and it is a, a beautiful property that we have. Uh, actually, that one's 207 Coronado there, but uh, the pictures we were showing. But anyways, hot property listings. Check out PlatinumMVPRealty.com for all of your real estate needs. Platinum MVP realty.com Ron Fuller in the house. He's business developer, real estate expert. Welcome in, sir. Ha, Mr. Rhymes, I've got so much to talk about. Yeah, man. Rich content for your smart listeners. I love it. Yeah, it's Intelligent Talk Radio. Got some intelligent folks in oh. studio here today. Always. So we're yeah, going to talk about Trump's tax plan, how that's going to affect us. Okay. But let's talk about business growth. I want to I want to highlight DR Horton Homes, something they've done right. We're talking about winners, all winners today. Yeah. Julie, who I met in Whole Foods, my second favorite thing to do, Brandon, is eat healthy. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. good. So she recognized me from the show. She, she do you know Brandon? Yeah, I'm like, yeah, I'll, I, would you get his autograph? She didn't really say <laughs> that, but she admired your show. And I'll tell well, you what, nice. I admired her. She uh, she thinks like a business person. She's all into it. And she is wanting to learn everything she can. She listens to this show. She must watch it. Uh, I'll tell you, she's doing some gaming remote, something with, with the video games. That's just, cool. just on fire with it. And so what I wanted to talk about, so I want to really highlight a builder I really, really, really respect, D.R. Horton. Through the tough times, through the tough economy, they had a business plan. They put it in action. They kept growing. They kept pushing through. Top, top for 12 years, top builder in the country. You've got to plan things as a business. When your business is running you, you're in trouble. You're in trouble yeah, quick. That's right. You run your business and you're running your business ahead. That's you, right. You're looking ahead. And when you do that, sky's the limit, especially here in Tampa. It's incredible. Yeah. Reactive versus proactive, right? Mm, That's amen. the key. Amen. Absolutely. And, and uh, you know, one of my favorite quotes when I speak, do public speaking is I talk about uh, Dr. Edward Banfield from Harvard. He conducted a 50 year study into the upward 
socioeconomic mobility in the United States and other countries. And that's exactly what he found. Mm -hmm. He found that the longer time perspective you have when developing your plan, that's going to tr contribute to your success. Yeah, it's that reaction. It's that knee jerk rather than this is what I had planned. And when the things go right, and your position to take advantage of it, especially with resources. You know, if you're making $50,000 a year on your job, you should own your own business. I mean, at that point, and, and it's so exciting, the opportunities that this country affords you. There's minority loans, there's, there's special, uh, there's loans and programs for women-owned businesses. There's so many things you can do mm -hmm. in this country. And if, if you're making $50,000 a year or less on your job, and you're you're trading your time. You're yep. you're actually selling your time to a boss. Yeah. Who's profiting on you? You take it right here and you say I can do this. Yeah, and there's a way that you can do it now with the power of the internet. I mean, you can learn anything, you can launch a company mm -hmm. in the hours of, you know, if you work till five, you commute home, you eat, you know, seven to 11, right? There's yeah. a lot of time there to be able to make money and create a new career. You know, the day that you don't go to work, the day that you love what you do is the day you've really learned how to live. Yeah. And as a business developer, being in real estate, I don't go to work. I do this radio show. It's not like work. It's, it's fun. It, it, it grows you as a person. If you, if you think independently, if you're not an entrepreneur and, and you want to lead and you're a sheep, that's okay. And that, that really is okay. But if you are an independent person and you want more out of life, you listen to this show and you go grab your business by the horns. Yeah, absolutely, Ron. So what do you think about, you had mentioned the tax the mm -hmm. tax plan that was changed and some of the things. Have you seen any of that or heard examples of how that's affecting businesses? You know, Brandon, it, it, what it's going to happen is it, now we're into that season. People are going to their tax professional. And by the way, because, because of some of the great programs that Trump's implemented, if you haven't had your taxes done professionally, this will be the year to do it because you can take advantage of it. So Brandon, people are going to start feeling it. So mm. the next the next 90 days, people are going to really start to take advantage of it. Yeah, that's that's interesting because a lot of these things, they, they take a while to get set in place. Precisely, precisely. Yeah. You get elected, you get in there and you, you make some changes. You, you got to get it through the House and Senate. When you get these bills passed, it's that following year, and that's what we're going to see. I think we're in for an incredible year, 2019. Yeah, yeah, we hope so. We really, you know, you look at the economy, you look, and then a lot of times when we hear these words of, uh, you know, the, the, sometimes when talk they talk about these recessions looming and these things, mm -hmm. it's more of a national numbers. They're talking about national numbers, especially when we zero it into more of a micro level of the, you know, Tampa, St. Pete, Palm Harbor, Clearwater. I mean, what a great area that we live, work, and play in. You know, when I listen to the media, I almost think that they're 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 almost philosophical about it. Mm -hmm. You know, we're going to have this market reaction. No, they're, the basics are different this time. Mm -hmm. The underfooting, the foundation, the problems we had in 07 and 08 were, were on a completely different level. I say bye bye bye. We're going to rock. 2019 is going to be an incredible year. Yeah, it's interesting when you think about the, the different programs and how they're going to they're going to play out. Uh, and then on the flip side, you do have lots of student loan debt that's kind of mm -hmm. looming. Mm -hmm. So yeah. how does that student loan debt play into the the uh, equation? Uh, and then, of course, you know, the mortgage debt that we had back then, like you said, that was that was hopefully a one time event. It's not going to get that crazy mm -hmm. again. But student loan debt, that kind of worries me a little bit, Ron. Yeah. You know, isn't it interesting, though? You see the student loan debt became an issue when our economy sucked, when we mm -hmm. were just in the tank. Isn't it funny how loans and programs seem to become a problem when you're not pulling in money? So, and and by the way, in Europe, there's going to be some growing pain with Europe, I, I, but it needs to happen. That independence needed to happen in Europe to get healthy again. So back to your student debt. Yeah. One thing that that's trending is college graduating, trying to get a job, trade schools. People are not seeing college as the expense that it used to be. People are getting a little more, uh, should I say, practical. Mm. I'm going to go to school to learn what I need. I don't want to go there to party. I don't want to graduate with a lot of debt. I'm, I'm here to get a job. And I think that trend is going to be good for us. The universities pull in a ton of money. But I'll tell you what, it's, it's about getting a job. It's about getting a, a well-paid job. And people can go to school later. Uh, but the student debt, yeah, you got to pay it. And I'll tell you what, the government isn't allowing you to snake out of it like like credit card debt. Right. But the key is you get a job, you get a good paying job, you pay that sucker off. Yeah, man. Yeah, I told you I'd, I'd listen to a great audio book. I'm about halfway through 
never split the difference, negotiating ah. as if the, your life depended on it. Chris Voss, interesting story. You know, one of the main things he talked about is he said that going into a negotiation or going into anything in life, you're 31% smarter if you're in a positive attitude versus Absolutely. a negative attitude. Absolutely. You know, it's so much of life depends on that, you know, that key thing. We hear it over and over attitude. Uh, you know, it's not about your aptitude. It's about your attitude, you know, all these cool little fra Absolutely. phrases, but uh, yeah, so good stuff, Ron, how can people find you? Do you have a, a preferred spot they want to text you or yeah, call you, you can, or email you can, or what's can, best? Email me, ronfuller2415 at gmail.com. ronfuller2415 at gmail.com. Okay, awesome. Well, more from our expert contributors uh, coming in studio. We got Kat Montemuro representing Infinity Medical. Um, Alexa's in the house as well. Stay with us right here on the Consumer Quarterback Show. More from our expert contributors and our feel-good story of the day coming up right here on the Consumer Quarterback Show, ConsumerQB.com. Hey, I'm Ken Shamrock, and you're here with Consumer Quarterback Show. And I say, Brandon Rhymes, knock out your competition. To get in touch with Brandon, call 813-670-7372, online at ConsumerQB.com. This is the Cannabis Podcast, powered by TrueLeave on Radio Influence. It's an inside look and the scientific facts in and around the world of medical cannabis. Now, here is your host, Ian Beckles. He's a successful entrepreneur, published author, top listing agent, a real estate and finance expert that goes to bat for you every day as a consumer advocate. Your host and the consumer quarterback, Brandon Rhymes. listening to the consumer quarterback brandon rhymes cutting through your typical media nonsense and offering you a rational and unbiased perspective on current events and life in tampa bay online at consumerqb.com all right welcome back thanks for sticking with us brandon rhymes here i'm your host of the consumer quarterback show owner of the platinum mvp team at keller williams realty i'm a top listing agent here uh, in tampa bay published author and uh, professional speaker we got an upcoming event coming up as well uh real excited about our buyer seller seminar on february 28th uh, 6 to 8 p.m over at cox media group uh, great opportunity to come and learn more from our expert contributors credit mortgage title inspection so much more uh save that date and let's give a shout out to our 
our official hotel partner of the Consumer Quarterback Show, the Bill Maher Beach Resort over on Treasure Island, the beautiful beaches of Treasure Island. And this is a great hotel, whether you're planning a wedding or a business trip or just a family outing, the Bill Maher Beach Resort over on Gulf Boulevard and Treasure Island. They've got two pools on site. They've got a beautiful beach and uh, just a great restaurant as well. you got Sloppy Joe's uh, is the restaurant on site. Bill Maher Beach Resort, Gulf Boulevard, Treasure Island, the official hotel partner of the Consumer Quarterback Show. Let them know the real estate quarterback sent you. Take them up on special offers and incentives just by mentioning that you're a fan of the show. All right, in studio today, Kat Montemurro, back in studio, Infinity Medical Institute. Welcome back. Thank you. It's great to be here. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, Good it. to see you. Thank you. Thanks for coming in. And also Alexa Rodica uh, making her debut to the show. Hi. Nurse practitioner, Infinity Medical. Yes. All right. Nice so, to be uh, here. Some good stuff here. So why don't we just start, you know, Kat, with an overall, sure. you know, what are we talking about here? Infinity Medical Institute. Yeah, um, absolutely. We, uh, we primarily um, have patients that are deficiency in bioidentical hormone therapy. Uh, we assess them with a blood panel. Uh, we also have um, them come back and we uh, have our nurse practitioners go over their blood panel, uh, assess them as to uh, the benefits of the um, therapy as well as if they are candidates of the therapy. I do know statistically that patients do have deficiency, when, women and men, uh, from the starting ages of their 30s. We have patients from their 30s all the way up to their 90s uh, because of the benefit of the therapy and what we do in our protocol. Yeah, 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 it's awesome. You know, it's really interesting stuff when you when you look at how you can live a better life. You can live a more fulfilled life. And it's everything from just energy levels, libido, um, all types of situations where this can help you. Uh, so Infinity Medical, and you're right down the road from us too, we right are. off of West I love Shore, it. Right? I love our, <clears throat> we've been there for 10 years. <clears throat> Excuse me, I took over five years ago. We have a wonderful practice. It's extremely proficient, professional. Uh, what you see is what you get. Um, our uh, physicians have a wonderful credential. We have a medical director, Dr. Mariah Moffitt, and um, nurses. We are open Monday through Friday. We see patients Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Uh, we absolutely positively do not book two patients to one practitioner. We are extremely respectful of your time. Education is priceless there. Uh, we monitor you five times a year, uh, new patients, four times a year, existing patients. Our only source of advertising is Florida Healthcare News and nothing but um, referrals. Love it. Love it. Mm -hmm. Great stuff. You know, and when you look at this, it's it's uh, men and women, you know, because I think that's probably one of the the top misnomers in your in your industry is where you know men are looking for the the bioidentical hormones to you know increase their levels but also women have hormones affecting uh, their feelings as well sure you have perimenopause which generally speaking are women in their uh, early 30s to 40s I start at 37 I'm 49 I've been on the therapy for 10 years um, it I've I've been doing remarkably well and I'll tell you why <clears throat> and then you have menopause and then postmenopause. I feel terrible for the women who um, have hysterectomies, partial hysterectomies, because that means they have no hormones. Mm. Uh, the women who are in perimenopause pretty much generally um, encounter uh, symptoms like uh, night night sweats, night sweats, hot flashes, mm. weight gain, low libido, no energy. Mm. The way I identify it is just washed out, irritable, yep. um, disconnected, uh, not able to focus, um, yeah. manage life. Um, I know for me, when I get down to my 10th week, I know that I'm, you know, um, able, I'm ready for my pellet therapy. I, uh, what else did I want to tell you? I find that a lot of women come in initially, not understanding what the benefits of the therapy is. Uh, they wind up coming off a, a majority of their medications. A lot of them are misdiagnosed. Mm. Uh, they're used to uh, traditional medicines um, only because they were unaware of the benefits of the bioidentical hormone therapy. Mm -hmm. um, it absolutely targets uh, diabetes, osteoporosis. Uh, and in a couple of weeks, you'll have Dr. Linda Cox on the air with me, who actually had polio. Wow. And she has a lot of case studies and she's written a book on us about the benefits of the bioidentical hormone therapy. Um, we have saved marriages. Mm. Um, the best thing that I can hear that if that's rewarding to me is that I changed someone's life. And yeah. that means not only 
um, with their hormones, but their lifestyle. Mm -hmm. You know, they're not depressed. Um, their relationship is um, reinvested. Uh, they have uh, time for themselves because they can manage things. They're not irritable or disconnected or uh, quickly aggressive because of their circumstances that are unmanageable yeah. uh, personally and in their um, in their workplace. Yeah, that's it's a very you know interesting uh, business that has you know recently you, you look at where you know people they live this life they come through and their energy levels are low and they're and they're wondering why and there's you know there's so many different reasons why it could be the food could be you know a lot of it's the hormone a lot of it's the style of life their sleeping habits their eating habits there's a lot of reasons why but what we do know is that there's an option there's a way that you can live a better life with more energy uh more libido um, infinity medical institute.com by the way for all your questions infinity medical institute.com and we're talking about pellet therapy so pellet therapy versus the um regular shots mm -hmm. that's another area i'd like to discuss too sure um you have primarily everyone because of uh lack of um anyway you have a synthetic and you have a bioidentical hormone therapy a, a synthetic would be your you know your orals your creams your injections um and what happens is your body really only secretes like 20%, let's say, of it because of urine and sweat. It's not in the bloodstream. So you're not going to have sustained optimization throughout their therapy mm. because uh, we call it masking the issue. Okay. You'll have symptom relief. Okay, you'll feel good for a period of time, whether it's a week, two weeks. Uh, and then obviously the disadvantages, I think it really um, hurts your adrenal glands. You wind up having a lot of issues with uh, your kidney and liver long-term. Mm. Um, you are absolutely not being uh, properly cared for by the physician. You'll go in and with all due respect to some of the physicians out there, they'll go ahead because they don't follow our protocol. Right. They'll go ahead and have you come in and do the initial, not even a blood lab. Mm. And they'll just say, okay, based on your symptoms, you need X, Y, and Z. Uh, and then I'll see you in six months. Mm. That's not the way it works. Right. I have a patient who came in. She had no thyroid issue. She worked out every day at Orange Theory. She ate very well and she couldn't lose the weight. She mm. got on therapy. She lost the weight. She came in uh, after her second treatment because we create a baseline. We're conservative. We have them come back and then we carry them out after the baseline. Mm. So she comes in her third treatment and she said, you know, I'm just feeling tired. I don't feel as though um, it was working very well in the beginning. Uh, however, you know, I don't feel as energetic. And, and it's because we took the time out and did an assessment on her symptoms, right. not only her lab, because she was burning through the testosterone. Wow. So we identified that and then we just made adjustments with her hormones and wow. her levels. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's amazing. And, and when you look at the, the scenario of how many people are probably feeling that or have that scenario playing out in their own life, uh, but they're just not taking action on it. Maybe it's it, there's there's different reasons why. Um, Alexa, you know, talk a little bit about what you've seen and, and what you're uh, doing over there as, an, as a nurse practitioner at Infinity, fin, Infinity uh, Medical. Um, well, for me, it's kind of fascinating that some of these women like she talked a little bit about being misdiagnosed. Um, you know, I did a lot in primary care before I came over and started doing aesthetics in this kind of um, industry. But so many women, they come in in their 40s, 50s, 60s, and they're just not feeling, they're fatigued, they're irritable, they're anxious, they're depressed. And so in primary care, all we kind of do is let's address that. We'll put you on an antidepressant. We'll put you on an anti-anxiety medication. Mm -hmm. So we're kind of masking the issue with all these other medications. Right. We in primary care don't ever really think to do um, hormone replacement therapy. So this is kind of fascinating. Like, um, you know, after a few treatments, they're able to get off of these medications because right. the testosterone and the estrogen really just boost their, their energy and their, um, it's like a mood stabilizer, you know, increases their, um, their energy level so yeah. it's, it's pretty amazing yeah yeah it's interesting and you you look at the hormones how hormones play in people's lives and you know just kind of relating it to teenager kids you know that's a that's a traumatic time in a kid's life or it could be where they're, they've got all these hormones going through their body they don't know how to use them so mm -hmm. they're, they're learning you know how to how to utilize it and their body's changing um so how does that relate it or does that relate at all i just you hear about it you know and then you have the flip side is when you know women are menopausal they're losing these these precious hormones as well mm -hmm. so it's interesting i mean actually in, in both men and women i'd say that um about age 30 is when testosterone starts to drop about it's about one percent a year mm -hmm. after age 30. 
So by the time you're 50 and 60, yeah. I mean, the depletion is pretty remarkable. Um, but yeah. what I found is based on so many studies that help with cardiovascular risks as well. Right. Um, and they help with uh, cholesterol, blood pressure, um, stroke risk, all these things, you know, all these other medications that people are on in right. their 40s, 50s and 60s that you don't realize the effects that it has on this as well. Like all your statins. So those mm -hmm. are those are, you know, synthetic drugs versus a hormone this these pellets are, are bioidentical hormones that your body already has in them mm -hmm. so it seems like a, a really smart way to go yeah awesome stay with us when we come back more from our expert contributors uh, we're going to dive deeper on uh, this pellet therapy offered by infinitymedicalinstitute.com check them out at infinitymedicalinstitute.com we've got cat and alexa here in studio and we're also going to talk about our feel-good story of the day as a champion wrestler surrenders match he could have won a really cool display of sportsmanship right here on the consumer quarterback show consumerqb.com hey everybody i'm forbes riley celebrity tv fitness host and creator of the spin gym i'm here today with brandon rhymes and you're listening to the consumer quarterback show great ways to get happy healthy and wealthy to get in touch with brandon call 813-670-7372 online at consumerqb.com This is the Cannabis Podcast, powered by True Leave on Radio Influence. It's an inside look and the scientific facts in and around the world of medical cannabis. Now, here is your host, Ian Beckles. Listening to the Consumer Quarterback, Brandon Rhymes, online at consumerqb.com. Brandon is Tampa Bay's number one consumer advocate for real estate and financial advice. Call Brandon today at 813 670 7372. Come back. Thanks for sticking with us. Brandon Rhymes here. I'm your host of the Consumer Quarterback Show. Giving a shout out to Brothers Easy Moving, the official moving partner of the Consumer Quarterback Show is Brothers Easy Moving, and they strive to be Tampa Bay's 
best moving company and they have great reviews to prove it. Uh, they have a Google rating of 4.6%, one of the highest in the area. They have an A rating on the Better Business Bureau as well as Angie's List and a 4.5% rating on Yelp. And they've also won the Super Service Award multiple times. Reach out to Brothers Easy Moving. Say hello to Gary and his team. Let them know the real estate quarterback sent you and take them up on special <laughs> offers and incentives just by mentioning that you're a fan of the Consumer Quarterback Show. And a couple of hot property listings. Uh, we've got 843 Bayou View Drive over in Brandon, Florida. This is a four-bedroom, two-bath property, and it's a 2255 square feet. Great property, and it's a waterfront, lakefront home, and a gorgeous property over in Brandon, Florida. A great opportunity uh, here in Tampa Bay. Also, 1667th Avenue South, St. Petersburg. This is a nice, affordable home, four bedrooms, three bath, and it is $255,000. Just a great opportunity, a newer roof, newer central AC unit, not in a flood zone in beautiful St. Pete, Florida. Another hot real estate property listing, PlatinumMVPRealty.com. All right, back here in studio, we're helping you win in any marketplace. InfinityMedicalInstitute.com, Infinity Medical in the house, Kat Montemuro, Alexa Rodica uh, here in studio. And... Um, Let's talk about the pellet, the pellet therapy, because I think, you know, again, people don't fully understand it. They, there's a lot of misnomers out there, um, you know, on the pellet side. What do you see in Cap? Um, well, as I told you, uh, we've been doing this for 10 years and uh, we have been growing exponentially fast, faster than we really anticipated. Uh, a lot of it is primarily women, but it's also men. Uh, men will find that uh, muscle repair is a lot quicker with their workout. Uh, their endurance is not remarkably well. They're not as strenuous with working out. Um, they do have the energy. Uh, we we keep a close panel on them um, with their hematocrit uh, hemoglobin, which you have to. Sometimes uh, a lot of testosterone will convert to estrogen, so we keep a very close eye on that. We review labs a week prior to their arrival, so we're prepared for them. Uh, we obviously um, have them come in once, excuse me, we have them come in um, or they at home excuse me, we have patients that are all over the place. So obviously not everyone's gonna come in for labs. So we have requisitions for them to get their labs drawn one week prior to their treatment. And uh, I just know that it's been very successful for women and men. Very cool. Yeah. Uh, a way to live a better life, a, uh, you know, an opportunity to just feel young again, you know, feeling, mm -hmm. feeling vibrant, you know, in your day, uh, both men and women can utilize the uh, pellet therapy. I uh, also have some other things happening over there. Uh, I hope I'm going to pronounce it properly here. Um, radius. Radius. <laughs> radius. I like radius. I like radius. It's radius. much more exciting. <laughs> radius. It looks, it looks got like the Swiss look, you know? The, the, yeah. So, so this is volumizing. Speaking of men feeling younger and better. Yeah. Right. Um, so like the, the amount of volume loss that happens in aging over time, um, I think it's kind of a taboo subject sometimes, mm -hmm. uh, aesthetics in men, men getting Botox, men getting fillers. Right. A lot of men are kind of against it. And I'm here to tell them that it's, I mean, it's pretty dramatic. I actually, you know, my dad's 65. I just did um, his fillers for the first time. And the amount of fillers that I, to lift his face, mm. you know, the 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 jawline, the cheeks, yeah. you know, it, it's pretty amazing. Um, so we kind of, um, the collagen and all that volume loss that happens over time. Right. Um, this is here to kind of fill it back to where, where it was. Yeah. Um, and he looks so much more younger. Yeah. Unbelievable. And, you know, people go to eye doctors and they get, they spend so much money in eye surgeries for right. brow lifts. Cause as we get older, unfortunately, you know, things start to, uh, gravity sets in. Dr so gravity it's inevitable, in. you That's know, right. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all over the place. But uh, yeah, Alexa is so proficient in it. She has been doing it for a very long time. Uh, she has wonderful credentials. She specializes in the injectables. Uh, everybody loves her. Uh, there's definitely no complaints and she, you know, she pretty much just gives you a, um, an assessment of exactly what is needed. You know, they gradually do what they want. There's no pressure. Uh, and then, you know, they just close on whatever the best need is for the patient. Yeah, yeah, it's it, and, and it's right here on West Shore Boulevard in Tampa, uh, convenient location, infinitymedicalinstitute.com. Uh, let's jump into our feel-good segment, more from our expert contributors coming up in the lightning round. But let's tell you something good here in our feel-good story of the day. Tell me something good. 
All right, we got a champion wrestler surrenders match he could have won as a state champion. Uh, Mark Bush has little competition, uh, but when he faced a fierce component or opponent who uh, got injured, he decided winning wasn't important. I practiced hard the entire week and watched him. I wanted to beat him, Bush said. It was a great match until under with under a minute left, his opponent injured his elbow, and there was almost no way Bush couldn't win now. Uh, so he told his coach, I got this, and went back out and do. he said he did what he had to do. So I guess he let him win, right? Is that the story, Rob? We don't have the video. We don't have the video. We're going to play the video, but we don't have it. So, yeah, he, he let the other uh, kid win in an uh, act of sportsmanship. So feel good story of the day. Every day we're telling you something positive here on the Consumer Quarterback Show. All right, let's jump into our lightning round. The lightning round! I am so good at lightning rounds! <laughs> I made you. All right, top round. tips, nuggets of advice, parting words of wisdom. Kat Montemurro, you're up first. Yes. Okay. Very good. What did you want me to, um, any kind of parting words of advice, top tips, things, you know, or, miss, we can do misnomers. You, you know, know I'm going to pass and give this to Alexa. No, Alexa. I was going to say, I'll pass and give this to you. Uh oh. Uh oh. The lightning you're round. On. So the lightning round, you know, basically. <laughs> Reflection. Yeah. Yeah. So we, so we have, you know, we've got the, the pellet therapy. I think a lot of times people think, uh, you know, they just don't understand. They, they hear about people getting the injectables. Uh, you know, and there's definitely a, a benefit to the pellets versus the injectables. You're not doing it daily or, or weekly. You know, the pellet therapy lasts three or four months. You don't really right? get those peaks and troughs like you do with injectables and creams and things. It's like a, a stable, you know, you get the peak and it's kind of a stable, you know, for six months at a time is what this lasts, six months. Yep. So as opposed to two week increments. Wow. So that's that's much easier for people to mm -hmm. you know kind of deal with. They you know a lot of times they think, well, I got you know I'd have to go get injectables. I'd have to deal with the needles and all that type of thing. So you're you're able to live a better life. Uh, you're helping the cardiac system. I think that's huge. I mean that's mm -hmm. a number one factor that people you know especially males are dealing with heart disease, right? Mm -hmm. So so this pellet therapy is going to improve their cardio cardio uh, vascular systems in mm -hmm. general. It, uh, it, it does a numerous amount of things, especially for men. Um, we have all different type of people that come in there, young, old, uh, athletes, people that actually um, really emphasize with uh, the health industry. You know, a lot of people today, unfortunately, um, are kind of naive of what goes on in our society, the foods that we eat, the exercise tolerance and stuff. We just make it easier for them. Uh, when they do come in, they get familiarized with the therapy, what, uh, how it's beneficial to them. Uh, they start to see change in their body composition. Yeah. Uh, they come to realize that, you know, their relationship is a lot healthier because they are not reactive. Uh, they're a lot more patient. Right. Um, a lot of them have an adverse reaction to medications. Uh, so therefore they are on off of their medications. They find that the therapy gives them more of a balance. Um, mm. Obviously they're there for multiple reasons and we address the issue and then just get to the core of the problem and make sure that we're able able to optimize them throughout the therapy. Yeah, I think that's a key word, optimization. You know, you're optimizing your life, you're living a better life, you have, you know, the the many advantages that we've covered here today. So it's a bioidentical hormone. Now, earlier you had mentioned a lot of the injectables, those are synthetic. Yes, a lot of for them. sure. This are is there molecule any... for molecule, what mm -hmm. your body produces. Wow. So it's just pretty much a straight up identical, like it says, bioidentical. Mm -hmm. So a lot of the shots that people are taking then, are those, are all the, those shots synthetic or are there some that are bio-identical? Are you familiar with that? The, the shots himself? Yeah. You know, they, they will... Um they will advertise that it's natural, but it's not because you always have to have some sort of component um, of a chemical in order to bind and to go inject it into the body. Mm. Um, you always want something in the bloodstream for a great reaction. But like I told you there, yes, there's disadvantages. It is chemically based. Mm. Um, it is not natural. You don't really know um, the reaction your body's going to have. Uh, and you don't have, uh, like she said, you, it fluctuates up and down. And you got Dr. Moffitt and Dr. Cox mm -hmm. in, in uh, you know, in the office there, kind of mm -hmm. overseeing everything. So that's yep. great. And we have Lisa Hahn. We have uh, uh, Virginia, who's our nurse. We have our MA. Um, I did want to emphasize to the uh, listeners that they can go online uh, to our website, uh, obviously, www.infinitymedicalinstitute.com. They can take a test online. They will have an automatically uh, a $500 discount. Uh, and then we can just do an assessment with their symptoms. They can come in and have their labs drawn. Um, everything is factored in. You have your labs, you have your uh, 
therapy or office visits all under one fee. There's no hidden agenda. Um, there's no price increase. Everyone stays the same year after year. And uh, if they want to email me personally, they can at info at infinity medicalinstitute.com. Awesome. Info at infinity medicalinstitute.com. Kat Montemuro, Alexa Rodica, thanks so much for coming in. And uh, we appreciate you listening to our show and uh, tuning in, checking out all of our expert contributors at consumerqb.com. And uh, please go out there and consider committing a random act of kindness, pack up some food or clothing, hand it to that person that you see in need and be a force for good in the community. We'll see you next time right here on the Consumer Quarterback Show, consumerqb.com. You've been listening to the Consumer Quarterback, Brandon Rhymes. Whether it's real estate, consumer, or financial advice, let Brandon call your next play. Contact Brandon Rhymes at 813-670-7372. That's 813-670-7372. Online at consumerqb.com. And join us next time for the Consumer Quarterback Show, weekday afternoons at 5 on AM 1380. The Biz. Are you a real estate agent looking to take your business to the next level and supercharge your marketing? Hi, I'm Brandon Rimes, owner of Platinum MVP Realty and host of the Real Estate Quarterback Show, syndicated radio and TV show talk program on iHeartRadio, 1025 The Bone, daily five o'clock drive time on 1380 The Biz, and our TV show is on WeBeam TV. We're looking for real estate agents that wanna join our team and supercharge their marketing, utilizing some of our innovative strategies. We utilize the Real Geeks platform, Facebook marketing, internet marketing, and a lot of the traditional methods as well. Postcard mailers mailed for you. Postage, signage, business cards, all paid for by the company. Aggressive real estate splits and ways to help you win in any marketplace. We need you to go out, take applications and work our plethora of leads that we're generating on a daily basis. Reach out by clicking the form below and we'd love to have a confidential interview with you. This is the Cannabis Podcast, powered by TrueLeave on Radio Influence. It's an inside look and the scientific facts in and around the world of medical cannabis. Now, here is your host, Ian Beckles. He's a successful entrepreneur, published author, top listing agent, a real estate and finance expert that goes to bat for you every day as a consumer advocate. Your host and the consumer quarterback.